fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Friday the 6th of September, <laughs> almost forgot the month there, 2024. Uh, and I hope you are keeping well, keeping fine uh, this lovely Friday morning. Um, I should be playing the Guardian's hard level Sudoku Puzzle in just a second. Uh, what's going on in the world I see and now the plan Musk's plan becomes clear. Uh, apparently Donald Trump uh, wants to appoint him as uh, head of uh, government efficiency commission. Uh, yeah, this is, remember Musk's uh, businesses have taken lots and lots of US government funding uh, in the past, but you know, like all of these super rich people, uh, they want to basically remove government. I mean, you know, just destroy government. They don't believe in government. They want to have free reign to do whatever they like. Uh, they don't want rules. They don't. Uh, they don't want to be constricted in any way. They just want to. I was going to use a bad word there, but mess over people, uh, especially poor people, uh, just in their continued uh, con collection of wealth. Hey, nasty, nasty person. Anyway. <laughs> uh, also, in kind of slightly related news, I see that those uh, addicts for Twitter uh, have signed up for VPNs in the in uh, Brazil, which of course uh, was ex quite expected. Uh, I guess everybody knows that you can use a VPN to sidestep your country's uh, censorship laws. Um, I think that was to be expected. But anyway, hopefully lots of people will not bother and just give up on Twitter. That would be much nicer. Right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? As I said, Guardian hard level puzzle. I can see two things, one leading on to the other. We have eights blocking across like this, which gives me an eight like that. And then the, um, immediately after, we are going to have eights blocking down and across here. That's the second thing I noted. Uh, is there any more? Yes, there is actually. In fact, with the eights, we can continue like this. And I think there's only one block missing. So that means we're sure to get it. Let's ruin all of that white space up there with a nice eight. We have one down here and here and across there. So there goes our digit one. We have three down here and across there. That gives us a three in that square. We have six across here and there. So that puts six into that square. Uh, with the sixes here, yes, we've got six blocking across here. We'll take it to the end. So six must appear in one of these two squares blocking across and up and down. So there's another six that will be useful. Okay, three blocking across here and up here, put three into one of these two squares, blocking across, three across here and three down there. There's a three, so three down here, across and across there, it gives us another three.
certain numbers seem to be lacking like I don't see is there actually a five on the board ah I don't think we've got a five on the board anywhere is there I don't think that we have any fives no it looks like we are missing a five hmm I was just thinking that um, I was looking at this block down here and seeing what's missing I know that's a four five and I was thinking where are the fives ah, not there not around okay so we have work to do Uh, all right, let's see what we've got then. Well, we've got a one here. Um, we've got two down here and down there. So there's our two, and we're left with four, five in these two squares now. Seven blocks up here and across there, that gives me a seven in that square. Seven this way and this way. We've got nine across here and across there. And so nine's going up to the top will give us nine there. And now we get our first five. Must be a five, don't have to think about what it is. It's the only, uh, it's one empty square in the column and I know that we don't have any fives yet. So I know that's a five without really thinking about it. One blocks across here, here's a one. This will be a four. Four blocks down here, here's our four. Here's our next five. And there's only one digit left here, which is a one. So we're left with five and seven up there. Uh, no, let's see. Let's go back to going through bit by bit. Because we'll get a one across here and one up there. So there's our one. We'll take it to the top. One is done. Four up here and across there gives us four in that square. Two across here puts two here. And we will be left with five and six in those squares. I just noticed there's one gap here. Plug that gap. Come on, what's wrong with you? Uh, that's got to be a five. Uh, so what's left over here? We're looking for two, three, four. Hmm. Ah, no. No, thought I discovered something, but. Not true. Okay. We do have four across here and across here. Uh, 
And of course we can get this because we just work out what goes there. And that's going to be two and something. So two blocking there. There's the two and the something that goes here is a seven. And so this has to be a five. Remaining over here, we're looking for seven and something. Seven blocking down. There's our seven. And the last number to get here is a two. Ah, two and three now blocking up here. So that means these squares must be two or three. This is going to have to be a four whether it wants to or not. And back down here, we're looking for five and nine. Nine blocks down there. There's the nine, there's the five. And just a five to finish this column here. Five and three across here, five and three up there. That's a pair of three and five. And it means that this, well, this can't be five. Uh, that has got to be whatever it is, six there, five there. Uh, up here we still need a six and now we've got sixes blocking across here so despite not having a, a complete set of at least one iteration of every digit it hasn't been a very difficult game is it? and I'm using the past tense because I don't think it's going to present any real challenge from this point onwards uh, not really let's just go through what we still need uh, can we get the twos not yet can we get the threes uh, not quite yet. Can we get the fours? Uh, four blocking up here and across there will give us four in that square. Four back this way, that way, and up there. Fours are finished. How about the five? Five blocks across there. There's a five. There's our seven. And uh, can we do any more than five? Yeah, I put a five. Up here and across there, there's our five. I remember that's a three. And one digit left here, which is a seven. And we're nearly there. We've also got seven blocking across here. So there's a seven. This will be nine, I think. So nine across there and up there gives us nine in that square. Uh, here's a two, two blocks down there, there's a two, this would be three, there's a three, a really very straightforward puzzle for Friday, it's to lead us into a nice weekend, I think that's the reason, uh, or rather it's just random, uh, there's no real reason for it, anyway, take care, enjoy life, bye bye.